What you say, great grandpa, huh? What you say, great grandpa? This channel is about So amazing, everyone, please welcome to the show, Ty Smith. What is the deal, yo, folks? I'm Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man. Welcome to the channel, Modern Renaissance Man. Double check to make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. If you have been following me for a while, if you are new to the channel and filling it out, continue to fill it out. Go to playlist, and when you click on playlist, you will see various topics on my channel that I do besides these videos like this and besides reaction videos, okay? Don't forget, while the video is playing, you like what I'm doing, don't forget to hit that like button, the thumbs up button, because it doesn't mean you like me, it means you like the information that I'm putting out for you, all right? New at noon, a 33-year-old man is dead after allegedly breaking into a Moreno Valley home. Here's some images from the scene. Police found Joseph Ortega with a gunshot wound as they responded to a burglary call. 93-year-old resident Joe Teague found Ortega and others in his home just after midnight. Teague says he repeatedly warned the robbers he had a shotgun but they continued to approach him and throw things at him he shot Ortega and held others at gunpoint until officers arrived Teague was questioned and released by detectives so anyway you guys just got done seeing that video right there and I'm telling you right now mm, mm, kudos to that man kudos to this 93 year old patron of america a patriot of america i'm sorry kudos to this possibly grandfather great grandfather he could be 93 years old and is showing how america is supposed to be how america second amendment works plain and simple and what i like about this they said this bad boy had a shotgun huh oh boy now we got to get rid of those now because a long rifle. It was a. It's a. It's a AR-15 style. Get the heck out. The man had a shotgun. Well, I don't think that they. They were only going to go in there to just try to see if he had any pick, pickled eggs and uh, pickled pig feet. That's the only reason why they were going in there. They weren't going to harm him. They were just looking for food. Get the heck out of here. Does not matter what they were in there for. He didn't invite them in. That is trespassing, that is burglary, that is robbery getting ready to happen. He warned them. He warned them. But guess what they did? Started calling them names, throwing stuff at him, and still walked towards them until he blew a freaking hole in them. Then held them at gunpoint till the cops showed up. That man is a freaking real true red-blooded hero American is what he is. Get mad at me all you want to. Say what you want to. He protected his kingdom. He protected his domain to my Christian friends out there who do not want to have a gun by all means don't have one, but I keep one super close all the time in case something like this went down. Yes. This man did what he was supposed to do. Well, Christians are supposed to have guns. What Bible are you reading that in? Well, if Jesus was here, if Jesus was here, if Jesus is here right now, he's inside me right now. Guess what I have a right to do? Protect myself. If I was back during the Old Testament and the New Testament times, you guys would be sitting there saying, well, if you know what, you sure that God would want you to have a sword and a knife and a shield? I don't think it's necessary. Well, I mean, geez, you might need a knife, but you don't need that big of a sword. No one should have that many swords. No one should have that big of a knife. No one should have that big of a spear. <laughs> y'all know I'm making fun of something, y'all. I'm throwing shots. Yes, I'm throwing shots. But only because, folks, you have a right to protect yourself, your family. You have every right to do that. If this is New York, they would have arrested that 93-year-old man and been charging him for murder right now. <laughs> anyway, I know this video is short. I just wanted to bring you guys some good news. I know there's all kind of stuff going on in the world right now, but I want to give good news. I told you guys, if you have links and things like that to videos of anything related to this, where a person was being robbed or raped or beat up, whatever like that, and they defended themselves with a gun to neutralize the situation. I like stuff like that because that needs to be portrayed in more of a positive light, showing this is how you do it right here, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you protect yourself. That's how you use your Second Amendment. Look what the cops did. They put him all in there, sat him there for a little bit, let him go right back home. Why? Because he did nothing wrong. New York, you need to take, you need to look at this, New York. 
New York, you need to look at this, and this is how it's done right there, because in your city, another old man was being attacked by a thug, by a parolee, and he defended himself, and now you want to charge him with murder. Crazy. Man, that's crazy. Anyway, folks, told y'all this is going to be short and sweet. Don't forget to leave the thumbs up button. Click it. Like, click it. Click it right now. Click the thumbs up button right now so this video can be circulated within the YouTube algorithm. Don't forget, folks, I um, share it. Share, share, share. Tell friends and families about this channel. Tell them to subscribe to the channel when they get an idea what this channel is about. You guys will be the reason why my voice gets out there, okay? You will be the sole reason. I know I go around do speaking engagements, et cetera, et cetera, but as far as being online, you guys will be the reason why I will get out there, all right? Appreciate it. Double check to make sure that you still are subscribed, okay? Do that, do that. Do that, do that. I am Ty Smith, my Renaissance man, hoping to pray that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing, and most of all, I hope and pray every last one of you guys are in great health. Mentally, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. God bless you all through Jesus. What's going on, everybody? So, hey, check this out. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you taking time out of your day to view these videos. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Give the video a thumbs up. And also, right here is where you can catch the next video, the latest video that I've done. But like right up here, this is stuff that I've done kinda in the past. So in this area, you might find a video that I've done in the past. It can be funny, it can be something serious, it does not matter. But this is something that you can also do to check out more material that I do in my channel. Cause I do a lot in this channel, all right? So again, appreciate everything from you guys. Keep on watching it, keep on supporting it, and God bless you all.